Listen, I get it. You have a young body and you want to celebrate. So I asked public safety, a couple frat kings, and the police station. What's the best advice they had for throwing parties and not getting caught? Let's check that out. Number one, keep it inside. Don't hang out in the yard. Don't pee on the grass. Don't litter. Don't wait for your Uber on the sidewalk, you dingus. If you keep it indoors, you'll probably be good. Number two, shut all the doors and shut all the windows. This is a great way to keep things quiet outside. It also makes sure that everyone stays sweaty. Number three, keep it low key around 11 p.m. That's usually just around the time that cops start patrolling, so why not turn down for that? Number four, inconsistency is key. If you have a party every now and again, you're probably gonna be all good. But if you have wine Wednesday like three times a week, your neighbors are probably gonna get mad. And that brings me to number five. Make sure you have a good relationship with all your neighbors. Just swing by and say hi every once in a while. And stop stealing their mail. Don't move your fence so that your backyard is bigger. Don't bark at their dog. Why would you do that? I've said it time and time again. A happy neighbor is a happy party. <laughs> uh, well, this has been a real treat. Uh, this is Jacob Larson signing off one last and final time. And I hope you have a great party.